Steamtown had only been announced the previous fall by F. Nelson Blount, its founder. Number 47 was originally slated to operate on the Cheshire branch of the Boston and Main Railroad out of North Walpole, New Hampshire, until the B&M was unable to come up with a lease agreement fast enough. The first operation was hastily switched to Bradford on the Claremont and Concord, a short line owned by Samuel Pinsley. Bradford still had a picturesque station and a water tank from the earlier steam era. Many of our scenes show number 47 in full stride along the shore of New Hampshire's beautiful Lake Sunapee, with a fleet of yellow wood coaches salvaged from the Boston and Maine's work train equipment through Newberry and Mount Sunapee. Although number 47 was reportedly in excellent condition and handled the trains in both directions with ease, its maintenance records had been lost in a fire in Canada. The decision of the Interstate Commerce Commission locomotive inspector was blindly emphatic. Without paperwork, the engine could not operate. The fire was dropped on August 26, 1961. The locomotive is a static exhibit at Steamtown today. A highway now slices right through the site of the Bradford station and water tank.